scary news, you guys. Yeah, we have, we have a rat, like an actual rat. Like it's, it's almost as big as my mom's head. Well, my head ain't even big. <laughs> so we just, okay, so this is a rat trap we made. So it's gonna go down in here, right? So this is a rat trap. So it's gonna go down here, obviously there's peanut butter on the end of it. It's gonna go down here and he's gonna be trapped in there. So I do feel like, what if this thing is like, what if it tips over and he tries to get out, you know? So we're gonna try to like melt it together because I don't have tape. Okay, buddy. Ready for this? I don't really think you should be doing this. I think you should let me do it. Uh -uh. All right, that was a great try. My turn. What? That was it. That was your lighter experience. BRB, guys. <laughs> we're back. So I don't have any um tape to tape this thing closed because it just is kind of like flimsy-ish. So I don't want him to like turn it over and get out, you know what I mean? So I need to figure out a way to keep it closed, but I don't have tape. I tried to burn it with the um, lighter, like to melt it together, but it wasn't fusing together. It was melting, but it wasn't fusing together properly. So, um, I don't know what I'm gonna do. It's late right now, so I'm gonna message you guys when I, not message you, but I'll show you the results tomorrow and let you know what happened and how it went down. I'll let you know. Hi, y'all. Grand Rising. So, the kids are going to school and I'm trying to get into a routine. I haven't been in a routine for a very long time. So I'm starting today. So after the kids go to school, I've decided that I'm going to walk up this mountain that is like five minutes from my house. People drive from wherever they live just to walk up this mountain. So I'm gonna go do that right now. And I will see you guys when I'm on the mountain, okay? Oh no, there's an iguana in here, or a little lizard. Can't be bothered. <laughs> also, um, I was telling you guys about this rat I have in here. So I bought this trap, right? And I put a piece of bread on the trap, but I wasn't thinking. I should have put the bread on the center of the trap. I put it a little bit closer to like the outside of the trap. So I think the mouse just like took it off the trap and didn't actually go on the trap. So um, I hope he's not like smart. I hope he's not like, oh man, this is a trap. I don't know. I kind of felt like it was supposed to work. So I repositioned the bait. So hopefully maybe when I go for this walk, he'll come back out and like actually go on the trap so I can throw it in the garbage. The only thing is I don't know how to like kill these animals. I don't like killing things, you know? Yes, I know I eat chicken, but I don't know how to kill. I don't want to be a killer personally. So um, we'll see. So this is where I'll be going these mountains it seems super far but it's not at all it takes like half an hour to climb to get to the top so this is the beginning of the hill which I walk all the way to the top it seems like impossible to get to when you're driving by, but it's really like a 15 minute hike up this hill. Anyway, I'm gonna actually try to get there like fast, I'm gonna run-ish. So I will call you guys back later. Okay guys, mid halfway. This is the view, so beautiful. You can see the whole city of Accra. Yeah, beautiful. 
that's where I live. There's still a little bit more though. Oh God, it's further than it looks. Okay, guys, guess what? Came home, showered, okay? So I had a sticky trap. Let me show you what the sticky trap actually looks like. Okay. Hold on. So this is a sticky trap, okay? This is the one I bought. So it looks like this. So it has like sticky gooey stuff, right? So when I first put it out, I put the food like somewhere, like right here. But the rat, he just took it off without going on the trap, okay? So I woke up this morning, the bread was gone. So I was like, okay, let me, let me like put some peanut butter on these button things, okay? So I put the peanut butter things and I went for my walk and when I came back, he licked these clean. These were clean. He licked them clean without getting stuck again. So I was like, oh, I'm gonna have to get another trap. So I put a Cheerio in the middle of this trap and then I was editing. So while I was editing, this thing ran across the whole room, like it ran from here all the way here where I had the trap and he got stuck on the trap. So I put a bucket over the trap and him, okay? His two back legs got caught in the trap. I wanna show you him, but I don't know if he's, I don't know, he's there. What are you doing in there? So he's there. I don't know how stuck he is and I'm even kind of nervous to take this paint can off because he might like be strong. I don't know. So he's under there though. So I caught him, I caught him. So I think this should be the end of my rat troubles. My only thing is I'm not a murderer. I can't, I don't have the strength. I am terrified. I don't want to kill anybody. Oh I don't want to kill him. Like, I should have thought about this. Like, how am I going to kill him? I don't want to kill him. I don't even think I need to. I was thinking of just like taking the sticky pad to like the woods or something and just maybe like letting him go there. I don't know, man. This is kind of like scary. So I want to get one of these um, Ghanaian men <laughs> to come inside and maybe like help me. <laughs> That's brutal. Hi everyone. That's so, brutal. so guess what? We got the rat. We I, I caught it. It's outside. I brought it outside because I don't know. I was going to maybe. So at this point, it's been struggling and rolling around. Oh my gosh. Poor thing. Poor thing. He's just like. Ah! Look at him. Look at him. He knows I'm talking about him. So he's been rolling around and getting even more and more and more sticky. I feel so bad. So I was hoping I could like let him out somewhere. Sorry, are you gonna take him, Christian? Wait, wait, Christian, what are you gonna do with him? You're gonna you're gonna bury it? No, free it. I need you, we need you to free it. No, when you free it, it's going to enter somebody's room. Is it? So you have to kill it. No, I, I want is it, it to like... How, how it's behaving? No, I want it to like run, yeah, is run. Is it? Look, look, it's gonna escape. It's gonna escape, you see? That's how they are. Open it. Is it now, it's getting off the card. Wow, he's, he's screaming. Jordan, did you just squash his head? No. Yeah, did you, nice. did you squash his head? Lord God, you put the thing on its head, man. Pull the thing out the wall. Pull the thing off the wall. There, now you can put it over it. But don't squash his tail, dear God. This is just too much. I guess so I how are you gonna kill it? I wanna, I wanna bring it. Wait, wait! I, I wanna bring it, like, to the gate, so it'll run, it'll run, and then maybe go to the sewers. Is it this one, when it's, it's run, like, it's going to enter somebody's room, is it, which is very, very bad. And you know what they, they do most? What? Like sometimes when you put your money down, they can't even start chewing it. You see? And maybe you eat, you don't wash your hand, they will just come and then they'll just taste your hand. 
I guess you understand. So you can, even I... dig, you can even dig here and then bury it. That thing will happen. Yeah, it's probably, to... it's probably just gonna dig underground. No, it's gonna be dead. Well, I'm not gonna watch at all. But well, where's the blue bike? <laughs> They're not leaving. Why They're not you? leaving. Why are you going to? So what exactly? How are you gonna kill it though? Okay, maybe you can drown it. Oh. No, don't step on its tail. No, like I just want to um, see how it's it's going to do. It's stuck. It's not coming off. No, it can. It's can. Nah, it's man. He's been on that all day. Yeah. You see, um, it's been it's been struggling to you know get um his or her freedom. So we have to kill it. But can maybe drown it, drown it. That seems the most humane. Is that inhumane? Close the close the book on him. Close the book. Jesus Christ. So what are you gonna do? Exactly how are you planning to kill it exactly? I wanna hear this. What was your plan? You would do that? Oh my god. So wait, how many times have you done this? Most of the times, that is what I do whenever I see them. Because I hit them. Jesus. Uh -huh. Because when you put your money down, they can do justice. <laughs> You're all dying. <laughs> so I don't like them. I don't. So. I oh, know. God, I'm so stressed out. I don't want you to do that. Can you just drown him? Can we just fill the bucket in there and just drown him? Or if you like to, we can, we can try. I can't believe this. I'm talking about killing someone. No, we are, uh, we are talking about something that will hurt you too. Damn. So what are you gonna say? What, what were you gonna say? You know, like, you see, when you see these things, these things, you know, when you have to, you have to make sure you put it outside or you kill it. That right? is the best way you have to do it. The and best because way. Because you cannot train them. But we can. No, we can. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. No, we cannot. I don't want you to step on its head, though. Even if you chopped its head off quickly, that would feed, make me feel better. No, that's all, that's all, that's all, it's, it's going to have more life. Because it's like, it, you take somebody's leg off, still that person can survive. What do you say? Okay, you know what? <laughs> okay. So when you kill I it, then can't. You, you, you kill it for it to go. I can't. I can't. I can't. Why, you, you, can't, you can't watch it to be killed or what? Looks like, it seems like you really want to do this. Yeah, I mean it. That is why I'm here. I can step on it right now. You know? We will be back. I'll let you know what happens. He stepped on it. He stepped on it. You're crazy. He's crazy. He stepped on it. He stepped on it. Ow. What is that? You straight cancer? I know, okay. Even the 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 stuffing tender, the guy we start eating. That's sad. Oh sad. Okay. He's dead. He's dead. I'll never tell you about my rats ever again. Oh you have to. You have to fight it I don't want to be a murderer, <laughs> which I am now, a murderer. So the rat is gone. Kind of sad how he had to die, the way he had to die. I think of a more humane way to, to deal with this type of stuff. So I have this back room here. And this hole is the drainage for like a second kitchen. So there'd be another countertop here. Don't mind that. There'd be another countertop here. The kitchen would be here. So that actually leads. Let me show you where it leads through this door. Through this door. And I have a sewer. This is an actual like sewer drainage system. So from what I understand, that hole, that hole that I just showed you, it comes to this drainage system. So basically the rat came from this drainage system and up this hole into the house. 
So I actually stuffed this hole with, um, what is it called? Like um, steel wool. They won't bite through it because it cuts up their mouth or something like that. So that should be the end of my rat problems forever. But um, yeah, that was a bit, that was a bit crazy. Anyways, you guys, I'm gonna live my rat-free life. <laughs> So if you enjoyed today's vlog, comment down below, subscribe, and all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys next time. And comment down below, guys, how do you deal with like rodents or pests or anything like that? Let me know what your experiences have been, okay? All right, so I'll see you next time. Love you.